welcome to the ecosystem spotlight where I read out updates from you guys and share it with the entire EOS community. So make sure you submit your updates, submit a short text that I'll read word for word, submit more context if you want me to be more educated about your project and give you the proper shout out you deserve. All right, so let's jump into today's ecosystem spotlights. Hey, happy Lunar New Year 2024. Wishing the EOS community a year of prosperity and strength in the year of the dragon. That's what's up. Shout out to the EOS Foundation China team for the great work they've been doing over the last couple of weeks and months, promoting the new Lunar New Year, ramping up those followers and that engagement on social media. Definitely like to see it. Make sure to follow EOS China to be notified of future updates at EOS Foundation CN on X. All right, next up, we've got Feed Your Monkey releases a farming update on EOS. Feed Your Monkey has released a farming update that introduces new mechanisms for the community to engage with, introducing peels and tree NFTs. Tree NFTs can be planted or grown and then fertilized with peels to grow bananas. Feed Your Monkey is home to one of the most active GameFi communities on EOS, so you should check it out if you're not already there. Head to feedyourmonkey.today to get started. Awesome. Thanks for submitting this update for the community. Next up, we've got antelopex.io. AntelopeX brings seamless bridging across the entire Antelope ecosystem. So Antelope X is an innovative service been built on Antelope Trustless IBC technology. The Antelope X service makes it easy to move tokens and soon NFTs across change seamlessly. Love to get updates from Antelope X. Of course, this product brought to you by the great team over at Boyd.com. These guys are OGs with the EOS community from the start. Love to see these guys continuing to release products for the Antelope ecosystem. Speaking of, we'll be talking today about the Antelope Firewall. So at the core of Antelope Firewall, Firewall are its advanced filter and rate limit systems. These allow node providers to sift through incoming traffic and identify requests that are likely to fail, thus preventing unnecessary load on the servers. By introspecting requests to be proxied, Antelope Firewall can block or granularly rate limit problematic IPs, authorizers, and even specific smart contracts, ensuring that potentially successful transactions are prioritized. So if you want to learn more, stay tuned. We'll be talking a bit more about it later on the show, but you can also check out the article shared in the chat. All right, talking about EOS EVM action, SFN support added to the EOS EVM bridge. SFNs are now transferable to EOS EVM. And um, if you're not familiar, SFNs are shoe fan tokens, which has been an art creator in the EOS NFT ecosystem for many, many years. Love to see Shufan expanding to the EOS EVM and also inscriptions and kind of leading the way here with her community into exploring all the ways that you can interact with the EOS ecosystem. So you can learn more about SFNs in the link shared in the chat below. Here, bridge.evm.eosnetwork.com is where you can bridge those tokens. So here we can see SFNS now enabled as one of these tokens you can bridge. There's all sorts of great tokens to move over back and forth between EOS Native, EOS EVM, USDT and EOS, of course, Chex, Absolute Beast lately, Zeos, Box, Banana, all of these great tokens from great projects in the EOS ecosystem. If you want to learn more, at EOS Inscriptions on X, where you can find out more information about these SFNS tokens, how you can earn some and what you can do with them. All right, moving on to some news from Paycash. Two million EOS recovered for the Paycash community on the EOS EVM. So on February 22nd, the Recover Plus team successfully froze two million EOS of compromised funds on the EOS EVM and is already in the progress 
of a final recovery. The PayCash team expresses their deepest gratitude to the Recover Plus team for their continued support and expertise in ensuring the restoration of justice. This not only highlights the effectiveness of the Recover Plus initiative, but also shows how reliable and advanced the EOS ecosystem is. As a sign of appreciation and commitment to creating a more secure blockchain environment, the team is committed to donate 5% of all recovered funds to further support and develop the Recover Plus project. You can find out more in the links shared in the chat below. That wraps up the EOS ecosystem spotlight section. Remember to submit your updates for next month's next month's show. Simply follow the link below. Send them early. Send them late. Send us updates halfway through the month. It's all good. We love hearing from you guys, and we love sharing the news with the community. <laughs>